Day 6 of the Novena to St. Philip Neri Philip and the City Philip did not choose the life of a solitary, but carrying out his ministry in the midst of the people, he acted as salt for all those who encountered him. Like our Lord, he knew what it was to do down amidst the depths of human misery, whether it was found in the palaces of the nobility or in the back streets of Renaissance Rome. He was from time to time a conscientious critic, an enlightened counsellor, and a smiling master. Precisely for this reason, it was not so much he who adopted Rome, but Rome that adopted him. For 60 years he lived in that city, which was beginning to teem with saints. If in its streets he met with suffering humanity, offering kind and perceptive words of comfort and support, he used to prefer gathering young people into the oratory, his own true creation. He made it into a joyful meeting place, a kind of gymnasium for spiritual formation and a center for the diffusion of art. This is an excerpt from Pope St. Pope John Paul II, his letter for the fourth centenary of the death of St. Philip Neri. O holy St. Philip Neri, patron saint of joy, you who trusted scripture's promise that the Lord is always at hand and that we need not have anxiety about anything. In your compassion, heal our worries and sorrows and lift the burdens from our hearts. We come to you as one whose heart swells with abundant love for God and all creation. Hear us, we pray, especially in this need. Keep us safe through your loving intercession and may the joy of the Holy Spirit, which filled your heart, St. Philip, transform our lives and bring us peace. Amen. Join me as we pray. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Thanks for praying this novena with us.